can see for yourself, there is a vibrant, gorgeous new mural in downtown Garland. But what makes this so unique is not the art, but the artist. He's proving that art transcends all boundaries. Photojournalist Ulysses Romero brings us his very unique story. Painting is incredible. Like when, whenever you're painting, the only thing you're able to think about is the paint on the end of that brush, which is the wonderful thing about art. You don't have to be the best artist in the world to be able to get the benefit from it, to be able to feel better from it and have a better day from it. Whenever I hear music, I see color. And this is a very musical mural. This is the Visual Aids Volunteer Building. I, I just feel really honored to be able to come here and do and do my little thing on the wall on this building where they do such great work. Let's see. In 2017, I became the world's first blind muralist. I started using techniques where I could touch and feel so I could make a line that I could feel and, and just navigate the canvas the same way that I would navigate a room. Colors are actually easy. I thought that would be the hardest part. Drawing is the hardest part. <laughs> I used to be afraid of heights a little bit, but then when I lost the eyesight, I, I just pretend like I'm not up very high. <laughs> Whenever I lost the eyesight, I was so angry and I was so depressed. I thought my life was over. I thought everything was just over. I thought whenever I lost my eyesight, it made me different than everyone else. And I, I realized that it actually made me more like everyone else. Everybody has something in their life at some point that's bigger than they are. You know, for me, it was, it was vision loss. For some people, it could be, you know, the death of a loved one. What do you hope people feel when they see this mural? I hope they feel happy. I hope, I hope it puts a smile on people's face. If, if I could put a smile on a person's face, then all of this work Eddie was Murphy. worth it.